Welcome back to the RV Rundown. I'm your host, Jason, and today we're taking a look at the 2022 Sunset Trail 212RB. This rear bath floor plan is great for couples. It features, it's right, sitting right under 5,000 pounds, and your total length is gonna be right at 26 feet, so you can definitely fit this in most state parks. Spinning around, we'll start at the back of the coach where you step inside the door. And here we feature a little pantry. It's a great amount of space. One little zonk I'm gonna give it. I wish they would have put a light up there in it, but that could be easily remedied with a little battery powered light. Sliding over, we have our interior control panel. This features just standard rocker switches and we only have one slide out on this unit. Sliding over to this door, we have our bathroom. Our bathroom is a pretty nice size considering how long of a unit we're standing in. Very impressive. Lots of space. Spinning back. Here we have our slide out and here we have a large L-shaped couch. I really like this couch design. Gives you a lot of space, gives you a little spot to lounge, but also they managed to hide some storage under that L. And here we see our table that would connect in to our bracket here, giving you a little bit of a dinette space, which is pretty nice. You kind of get the best of both worlds, a decent sized couch while still having a dinette. And also, this is a, this is a trifold. This will fold out and make a, about a little smaller than a full size bed. Over here, we have our 12 volt refrigerator. This is 11 cubic feet. This unit also can be optioned with an eight cubic foot gas electric fridge. Spinning back around, we'll take a look at our kitchen. Our kitchen features quite a large counter space for prep in this unit. I'm very pleased with the amount of counter space they were able to put in here. Also, they have a lot of cabinetry. There's plenty of storage. There's no lacking on that department. Have our oven along with our three burner cooktop with a glass cover. Also have a microwave up above by high point. Also some storage. And we have our sink down below here. And this features covers and it's a dual basin stainless steel sink. Also has a little wand that pulls out. And this surprised me, we have a 42 inch TV, that's right. A lot of places, it's an afterthought of where they put the TV and they put these little ones in here. We have a 40 inch, which is great. And it also can pan a little bit on the arm so you can see it from the couch easily. And it also flips the other direction so that when you're going to bed at night, you get to watch it on all on your 40 inch TV, which is great. Speaking of the bedroom space, there's no divider here. It's just kind of open, which is partly what makes this floor plan so large, but that might be a deal breaker for some folks. But because of this, they were able to fit a full size king bed. This is gonna be great news for a lot of people who want that king bed, but do not want a huge unit. Sliding over, we have our standard wardrobe configuration with hanging closets on either side, as well as Above, past their storage, we got passes all the way over to the other side. And sliding down here, we have little nightstands with a, with some USB ports and a 110 outlet. And see that sticker on there? These are connected to the inverter. If it, this unit we're currently looking at is not optioned with the solar package, but you can option it with two 190 watt solar panels and a 2000 watt inverter and the outlets with those stickers would be connected to your inverter, allowing you to run off-grid. Spinning back around, we have one AC in this unit. This, I believe, is a 13.5K in this one, but you can option it with a 1500, and you can also option it with a second AC. All right, guys, I think that about wraps up our Sunset Trail. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to comment below. And if you'd like to keep seeing con more content like this, please subscribe. And until next time, happy camping.